Today I'm going to show you how to set up a Gmail signature that looks professional but also has some fun. It's a great way to personalize your emails to others so that they know who you are and have all the relevant details in order to respond to your messages appropriately. For example, when you email a teacher about an assignment. Let's begin. First, you need to create a blank document in Google Docs and you'll go to insert table and create a two by one table. Now make sure your cursor is inside the box and you will do insert image camera to take a picture. You might need to, hi, you might need to allow your camera the first time that you do this. So make sure that you do that and then take a picture and insert. Now your picture's kind of big, so you're gonna want to grab the corner and slide it to make your picture smaller. And then hover over the middle column line and shift your line over as well. So now when we go to type in the other side, we don't have an awkward, you know, huge gap here. So now you're gonna type in your name. Even you're gonna type in um, your grade level and then each year you can update this to the appropriate grade level. You can type in your um, seminar teacher's name. And then just for fun, you can add some sort of um, quote or something at the end. Think big. Okay, and ha have fun with it. You can put whatever you like. You can put a, something about yourself, a favorite quote, whatever. So now we have everything all set up we need to get rid of these lines. So the trick here is to start at the end of your text and hold down your mouse and swipe right to left to select everything. And now we need to change our table properties. So I right click to get the option of table properties. My border, I wanna make zero point. Conversely, you can also make your uh, cell border white. Either one works. And then I say OK, and it goes away. So that's kind of nice. Now it just looks like a picture next to some text. So you've done the setup. Now you need to put it into your settings in Gmail. This is the second half. Put it in your Gmail settings and save it. So we're going to do the same thing in order to select all of our information. And we're going to copy. So Control-C is your copy. And now we're going to go into our Gmail. You have to click on the gear to go to settings. Click settings. And you now get all these options. So you have to scroll, scroll, scroll until you find signature. I'm going to click inside the box and I'm going to control V to paste in my signature. Now, if you want at this point, you should be able to highlight and kind of adjust, like maybe make your name bold or something. But your signature will not save at this point until you scroll all the way down and click save changes. This is very important. Click save changes. Now, the way to double check and make sure that you've done it correctly is to simply click the compose button. And as long as your signature pops up, you've done a great job. So at this point, send me an email. Let me know that you finished your signature. And hit send. And you did it. Great job.